My name is Shelly Ann. I was born and raised in the Bronx. I have three children, one that passed away. I'm blessed to have a baby. My name is Mia. And yeah, I was blessed to stay with a good family who loved me and took care of me. I get all emotional, sorry. I kind of went through a rough patch, you know, because she no longer was there. My mom was sick. She was half paralyzed. So I had to take care of her, take care of myself, and then I got pregnant, and then I had to take care of my baby as well. So it was like a lot for me. And I kind of grew up like um, just doing all the wrong things because I didn't have that stabilization at home to like keep me, you know, doing good. A lot of negative things happened in my life, losing my apartment, um, being in the street, I slept in parks, I would like go camping and open up a tent and sleep in there for like three months. I would go to friends house, shower, and you know, they would let me cook stuff and I'd just take it back to the park with me. I was crying hysterically really, really bad that the workers here were like, just take it easy, you're gonna be all right. At the end of the day, like, they kept me here and I was fine, I was able to eat, I had a roof over my head, the people were good to me and they still are. And it's it's been a very good experience and I'm comfortable. Not comfortable to say I wanna be here forever because you still have to do what you have to do to move on and move forward. But um, this is my home right now. And the workers, they're very good. You know, you could come to them and you tell them, oh, I'm going through this, or I'm going through that. And they, they're pretty much there for you, you know. When the new girls come in, I try to be like, welcome to Providence House. Make them feel at home. Make them feel welcome like they did to me. You got to help one another in here, you know. It's, it's not easy. Everybody's going through their rough patch. And you have to be strong for one another. It's just good to see people move on as well, you know, when they get their place. It's just like, yeah, you know, that inspires me. I'm going to be next, you know. I've waited long and I think I deserve it because I've been doing the right thing. So all that is going to come to me soon.